Welcome to Chimen Dunjia. Hello, my name is Dr. Chuan. I'm the Chimen teacher over here from Singapore. I teach people how to use Chimen Dunjia to change their life and using the technique and science to have a better direction to better life. Okay, so today's topic I would like to talk about is related to why Chimen those people who learn Simon and want to become a master, most of them are not successful. The fact is that Simon Dunjia is a skill, is a trade, is an industry, but most of them, they only learn the technical aspect of it, but they do not know how to let people know that they have the skill set to help them. So, one is a technical skill, and then the other one, letting people know about themselves. The master themselves is a marketing skill. So we cannot assume that after you learn Chimen Dun Jia, you want to become a master, you will become popular. It doesn't work that way. It's like you have a skill set, you learn certain skills, but nobody knows that you are good in these skills. So you still need to market yourself. You still need to brand yourself as a professional to let people know that you are good in this area. So what happened is that after somebody who is learning Chimen Dun Jia for three months, six months, one year or all, they go for a two-day crash course in Chimen itself and they hope to become a master and make money from it. So what they do is that they will do some reading for people and as time goes by, the word of mouth comes in and slowly more people introduce them, customers. And this will take many, many years, three years, five years, 10 years. And you have to be active and you have to go to every year, those uh, seminars, conference and give talks to tell people, oh, this year is, is a god. It's a good year. This year is, you know, a red year. What is the whole thing about? What's the outlook in this particular years coming forward? Well, this takes a lot of time. You see, the thing is that a lot of people, they don't understand is that they have to go through the process of marketing yourself, branding yourself. Some people, don't, they don't even know how to brand. They just do Chimen Dun Jia, Feng Shui, Ba Zi, and... Apparently, they, they sell crystal, they sell a lot of uh, feng shui items to hopefully can help people and make money from it. Then from there, it, it becomes a, a jack of all trade. You don't have a brand, you don't have a positioning to tell people that you are the master of the particular subject. You're everywhere, you're anywhere. And because of that, people perceive you as nothing. You're one of those hundreds and thousands of them out there. You see, to, to be successful in this particular trade, whether is it Chimen Dun Jia or Feng Shui or Ba Zi, you have to focus on one particular subject and tell people that you're expert in this subject and continue to do and become an expert and tell people, keep telling people that you are good in this subject. You see, it's, it's about Marketing is about branding, but of course, you must have the skill. You must have the ability to help people. I think that's the basic fundamental you have to be. If, you, if not, if you just learn three weeks of Chimen Dun Jia and hope you become a master, no, it doesn't work that way. Even if you go for a five-day crash course in Chimen Dun Jia, you will not even become a master. It doesn't work that way. Okay, you need to practice. It's like you have learned a certain martial art. And because of this martial art, you have to practice and practice and practice. Well, it's the same. In Qi Dun Jia, you have to practice. And it takes months and years of practice to become proficiency. I'm not talking about master level. I'm talking about proficiency. You have to practice, practice, practice every single day to become good in what you are doing. You see, so apparently a lot of people, they don't understand. And because of that, they thought that, okay, I have this particular trait. I learned already from the best of the best in this industry. And from there, I will become the best. No, it doesn't work that way. Okay, so I hope this enlightens some of the people who wants to learn Chimen Dun Jia and become a master. You still have to go through the process of branding and marketing. There's a certain years of route to be 
go. So, and from there, if you really want to go into this industry, well, have a chat with me and then from there we can uh, discuss some more. Okay, thank you for watching this video. My name is Douglas Chan.